Hi there, Paolo here. The fastest and most responsive website builder that anybody can use is Builder Alchira. And in this video, I'll show you what the add button on it can do. Before we proceed, intro. Welcome back. This is the Builderall back office. Builderall is an all-in-one digital marketing platform that anybody can use even without technical and programming skills. You can make websites on it, sales funnels, you can also do email marketing, and many more. So let's go down to the bottom and yes, you can also do chatbots on it which is a lead generating tool, a very powerful lead generating tool. Copywriting. You can also make online courses on it. Instagram autoresponder. It also has a CRM, even a webinar. And yes, you can also make websites through WordPress. If you want to go through this, if you want to check on Builderall, just I'll just put the link on the description of this video. So let's go straight to Builderall Chira, which is the fastest and most responsive website builder that anybody can use. As long as you can copy, paste, edit, and save, you can use Builderall. Click here and go click on enter. And later, at the end of the video, I'll show you why it is the fastest and most responsive website builder anybody can use. Now, let's go here. Let's create a new site. So, by the way, this will show you all the websites you've made on Builderall Chira. So, I have one website, demo, demo two. So, I have three websites so far, all for demo. But let's create a new one. Create new site. Definitely demo four for this one. Click on save. And to edit demo four, the website that we're working on right now, just go to demo four or this website and then click on edit site so we can enter the editor. Now, this is the website that we'll be working on and this will show us the pages it has and as of now we have the home page so let's go ahead and uh, click on edit page okay so right now we are already inside the editor for the website Click on the arrow, click on the add button, we have a panel and elements. Panels, these are like templates. Let me show you what these are. So let's say for example, first fold, these are actually the content that you would put on the website or on your website. So you won't have to think or worry about the content to put on your website you don't need to think anymore what do I put on my website how does it work so you have the first fold the blocks call to action contacts contents and more okay and yes you can also start from scratch by choosing blank panel 
So for this one, let's go ahead and just to show you how you would construct a website from scratch using the templates. So again, you just click on add, you have two options, panel and elements. So for the panel, let's say for example, I want to work on a website. So the header, you don't have to think of the header anymore, what to put on it, it's already here. All you have to do is choose from the panels or the templates. Also, your preferred design. So let's say for example, I want to go for this one. Just click on it and it's there. Let's add another panel. So add panel. Let's say first fold, for example, this one. Click on the arrow. As you can see, we are able to construct a website without even thinking of what to put on it other than of course the content itself but then again for the design on how your website would look like it's already here you just have to choose from the panels so so far we have the header and the headline of the website let's add two more quick so we're on add click on panel Want to collapse that, and what I want to put on uh, is uh, would be, let's say, pricing table for features. Let's go with features first. Okay, let's check real quick. It's here, and I want to add another panel. Just click on, just collapse features. Let's go to let's say pricing table. So let's say this one. See, we have the header, the headline of the website, the features of our business, the pricing or plans we have for the business that the customers can sign up for. And let's add la one last panel, which would be the footer. Footer is the one at the bottom of the page. So let's see this one. And voila website is done all you have to do from here is edit again the content and that's it you can move everything you can easily edit everything test demo you can save done that's how fast simple and easy it is I did not have to do any program uh, programming I didn't have to learn any of those because I don't need it, even any technical skills. And again, as long as you can copy, paste, edit, and save, you're good to go. You'll be able to use Builderall, especially Builderall Cheetah. Now, as I said earlier on the um, uh, intro, that this is the fastest and most responsive website builder that anybody can use. Meaning, when you, uh, when you make websites, this is for the desktop view or the computer view. As you can see here on the upper left, click on preview. Now this is how it would look like on the live or published website. But how, how it would look like on a mobile phone. On a phone, normally website builders, you need to make some adjustments. But let's check with Builder Alchira how it would look like. Click on preview. Click on this, and it's done. Look at that. Everything is real time. It's adjusted automatically as how it should be on the mobile phone view. See, everything is already in order for the plans. But if you prefer or if you want to still customize this or make some adjustments you can easily do so still okay so go back here back to editor so everything can be adjusted to your own preferences right now just click on the arrow so we have add panel 
and then we have those panels as you saw now how about the elements elements these are the well the elements or what consists of a panel for example the text okay these are the text the butter the box the butter so let's try this one I'm gonna add a uh, let's go ahead and add a blank panel so I added a blank panel which should be at the bottom so if this is our blank panel but we have the footer right here if I want to move this panel up just click on it left click on it there's a mini menu here just click on the arrow going up let's check if it did went up and yes it did all right I want it up again more up and it did went up and up again okay let's make this next to the header okay so now the blank panel is up let's go ahead and add some elements so add elements we have we can add texts which are these we can add boxes we can also add buttons we can also add a contact form an email marketing form an iframe an image which you can change a menu and a video so let's say I want to add a video so it's there I would also let's say let's go ahead and adjust this see I want to add a video here next I want to add more elements to it let's add a button so let's say for example this one so we have the register now button I'm gonna put it here let's say I want two buttons on it add elements and I want a buy now button go ahead and fix the buttons here make it a bit smaller right want to make changes on it on any of these just right click on the button by the way of course you can edit it you can also link it now linking it you have the option to link it to a website and if it's a website you have the option for the action wherein if somebody clicks on that button the website would open on the same page or on another page or window you can also direct the link to another page to a pop-up an anchor and a video you also have all the options to customize everything just by doing a right click on it. page okay let's go to add elements okay we're still on elements let's say I wanna remove the video just click on the trash can it's fine I would add, like to add an image on it click on image just drag it now we have an image I want to put the image here 
make it quite bigger I want let's remove the uh, buy now button change my mind so we have the image here we also have a button here now I want a contact form on it or an email marketing form So let's go ahead and remove the register now button and change that to an email marketing form. So the email marketing form is here. Let's go to this one. Make it longer. From here, you can customize everything. See? Button width, the field style, the size, the height of the field, right? The background color. As you can see, it's purple. You want to change it, you can just change it. So I have the border. So basically, everything can be changed. Advanced, by the way, if you want to use a, uh, if you want to personal, personalize a button and use it anytime whenever you make websites, this is what you this is where you go to click on advance and then save it put a description on it save it and you'll be able to use that uh, design of yours personalized design of yours on any website that you make okay that's the beauty of it now let's go ahead and add let's say I change my okay let's just put it here let's say I want to change a con I want to add a contact form to it. This okay. It's a contact form. I want to make the image smaller so it would fit. Contact form is here. All right. Or if you want to transfer it, contact form is here, and the image is here. I want to make the image a bit bigger. So we have the menu right there, and the image, or in the contact form right here. Or you can put the image there and the contact form on the right. the image a bit smaller and a contact form right here when I adjust it a bit lower and let's see what we what more we can add let's say some texts so if I'm to add some text it would be this one when I add it here Right. So from here, I want to put it on the center, and I want to add some stuff to it. So welcome. Center. I want to make it bigger. Six, oops, too big. This fifty.
family. Save from here. Just adjust it. Welcome to the iFreedom Blueprint family. So let's say I want to change, I want to fix this and change, have it change places with other stuff, put it up here, let's adjust this, put it in the middle. Alright. So everything can be customized without doing any en uh, encoding or any of those programming stuff okay really fast simple and easy uh, I'll click on preview so here's our website so far I'm gonna check the mobile view see welcome to the iFreedom blueprint family it's all here all right So if you want to learn more about this, again, I'll just put the description or the uh, link rather on the description of this video. So if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If uh, you think this would help other people, please do share it. And if you want to learn more, just subscribe and click the bell beside the, see, beside the uh, subscribe button so you'll be notified when I upload a new video. If you have any questions, just comment below or message me on my Facebook page and I'll either answer it or even make a video out of it so we can share the knowledge to everybody. So just, ju just like that, the video is over and I'll see you on the next one. Let's go.